everywhere you look, business and industry is searching for workers, not just service related jobs, but also manufacturing and the skilled trades. Tonight in our skilled workforce segment, Lou Baxter takes a closer look at ways to avoid college debt and also accelerate your earning potential. Preparing yourself for a high paying career can happen while you're in high school. Here in the Metal Fabrication Lab at the Erie County Vocational Technical School, students are learning how to cut and weld metal. But they're also being taught three things industry needs the most. Employees who show up for work, can read a tape measure, and be accountable. What we learn and what we teach inside of here is the ability to be employable. Whether you go and do something else, the same methodology of, of uh, getting instruction, taking instruction, doing a, doing a project, completing it, and then uh, you know, being able to be accountable for your work uh, is transferable to all industries. Not everyone behind these welding hoods is a guy. Logan Chris got a welding machine for Christmas, a gift as unique as she is. I'm really artistic in a, bu a, like, a bunch of different ways and I feel like metal fab is just another different way to kind of ex express that artistic ability and it's something different that not everyone kind of takes to and I feel like that's kind of what makes me unique. General McLean Sr. Kyler Alexander plans to begin an apprenticeship after high school to become a union carpenter. He encourages all students, college bound or not, to consider vocational education. You might change your mind when you come and see all the labs that are offered here. Uh, or even if you're uncertain about your career path at all, it's definitely check out this place or go check out a college or both. You never know. Like, I changed my mind. And while you're in high school, you can begin a co-op experience that will pay you to learn. Sebastian Grace is a McDowell senior in the Auto Tech program who goes to school at Bianchi Honda and believes co-op is the way to go. It gets you a really good understanding of like how the industry works and like what to expect when going out into the field and like you'll figure out whether you like like working in it or not and you, you're only still in high school so you can decide whether you want to do that forever or not. These students can start at the end of their junior year and all, their whole senior year making money out on co-op and as they you know actually reinforce the skills that they've learned here. We've got some kids already out there making $18 an hour in fields um, and it counts towards their education and, and that's the most beautiful thing about it. You're learning as you're getting paid to do that. Visit the on-air section of YourErie.com to see more skilled workforce opportunities. Lou Baxter, Jet 24 Action News.